this is an actual um, Bob Sanders for the Colts, but this one's legit. I bought this for my roommate from the NFL shop for his 21st birthday. That looks good. Sorry, my phone is ringing. Well, this one's legit. So there's the patch. Reebok vector over here. Numbers sewn on. Size down here. Name. Sewn. That's legit one. And then he has his fake one here. Which the numbers don't even look as good. This blue doesn't seem to match the Colts blue. But he does have the equipment that NFL shield on it. And that Reebok vector if I can get this thing open. pretty good. Anyways, that's that. Um, I'm not going to say that fakes are bad. I mean, if he, I think, only sells them for like $40 and they look pretty good. I mean, I probably wouldn't wear them because I'm used to the feel of the real ones, but I mean, for 40 bucks, they're pretty good quality. Again, they're not really supporting the team or anything, but they look nice. Here he has some package ones. This is um, Peyton Manning for the Super Bowl. Another thing, they never sell at the NFL shop or the pro shops with a captain patch or a Super Bowl patch. You have to buy those separate. So that's a dead giveaway. And here he has um, Montana. I think it's supposed to be a Mitchell and Ness patch on there. This looks bad though, because I don't think the um, NFL shield is supposed to be on this year for Mitchell and Ness. Most Mitchell and Nesses don't have a shield on it. Some do, but and they have it on here crooked. I don't. You can't really tell on here. Mm, I guess you kind of can. And this Jerry Rice it's supposed to be, I think, a '94 edition, 75th anniversary of the NFL. Mitchell and Ness with no NFL logo on it. This one actually looks pretty good. And then the uh, Drew Brees Super Bowl winning jersey patches again, which never get sold with unless they're fake. Equipment patch, which again kind of looks a little crooked. I don't know, just beware. If you. If anyone is selling a jersey for less than, like, I would say, like, 120 bucks, pretty much guarantee that it's going to be a fake authentic. But if you don't really care and you're still supporting your team, and, I mean, most of them now look like pretty good quality. So, anyways, that's the vid. Just beware.